Uh, this pose is a variation of reverse bird. Okay. So, so we'll go over here. here. Uh -huh. Reverse bird. We know with the reverse bird you can fall forward really easily. With the arms locked, dangerous, right? Yeah. Open grip. If there's a fall, legs down first. Beautiful fall. Tips. Feet placement. Bring this really low. Try not to do it too high. You gotta get the hip bones on the middle of the foot. So I'm aiming my toes back. Low. Over. Okay. Do this first and then grab the feet. And use this lever. It's just feel how you can lever her body by grabbing onto her feet like this, okay? From here, you can extend your arm straight out, Alexis. Good. So now when she does that, more weight's, more weight's falling forward. So you really have to grab here and leverage. Okay, just work with that first. Get a feeling what it's like to use your, her feet as a lever. From there, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pivot. We'll go back to reverse bird, Alexis, with the hands connected. I'm going to pivot one of my feet. I'm going to choose my left leg, pivot in, just like we're doing Ninja Star. Okay. I'll take my left hand out, grab her left foot. From here, now we have a crease here. And from here, she'll lift up my bow. Oh, uh -huh. over Lifting here? up, yes, and then she'll grab that foot. The key for this one is to stay flat. A common tendency is the fly will want to lift this hip up like this, and you'll roll off the foot over this side. Okay. Try to keep this flat, and the base, their ability to leverage, pulling this down will keep your body from falling forward. Okay. So Alexis, extend the left hand straight forward so there's more weight up in front. Good. There it is. So maybe a little bit of a, maybe a little bit of a lift. So I'm trying to balance you just on this foot here, right? There it is. I'll slowly take this off and extend like that. <laughs> so play with this leverage first. Okay. Yeah, yeah. No, I saw your face. That's why I was trying to smile at